Folks, this city is a modern tragedy because there is no giant communal place for people to eat together freely at a health food buffet so that the community can fellowship and, and meet with each other and actually be social like real humans in the world. <laughs> I, folks, I finally see this stuff for what it is. I actually can't believe how many people are addicted to this ridiculous armored vehicle lifestyle. Okay? Okay, people go into a store, they grab some crap, they come back out, they open the door of their armored vehicle, they get in, and they drive away. And they drive home to a little isolated box where they'll be all by themselves, not meet anyone new, not interact with anyone in the community, not grow their friendship network, not see anyone new, not meet anyone new, not get anyone's phone number, um, probably not meet anyone, probably not get married, um, and there is no human love and there is no spiritual fellowship in the community. From the dawn of time, um, God ordained that uh, human eating, human community eating in a common area was absolutely critical okay, to um, connection and uh, nour spiritual nourishment and uh, community. Oh my goodness, I see these symptoms everywhere. Women are struggling a lot. You know, one thing that happens to women in the midst of all this loneliness and isolation is overeating. They're so desperate to try and, anyways. Um, but um, you need, I repeat, you need um, a central eating place, okay, where people can, where the whole community can eat in a massive gathering place. Oh my gosh, like it's just like. Oh my gosh, it's just, it's a head-swimming nightmare. Grab my stupid groceries, head into my armored vehicle, drive home, sit by myself or with my one little, you know, friend that I, that I made in the world, also known as my spouse, and it's disgusting. It's, it's so antisocial, it's so devoid of family, it's so devoid of tribe. There's, there's no variety in it, you don't get to make friends, you, you know, you, you, you <laughs> I'm like, it's just insane. It's like everyone is a loner. Like, guys, like, this this whole automobile society has made everybody a loner. But I'm here to tell you the solution. The, so, the best solution you can do, okay, in the midst of this madness, is create a giant health food buffet in the center of town. That is the solution to this madness okay there is a solution I wouldn't be saying this stuff if I didn't offer a solution okay um, uh, what should you do okay all cities and mayors of the world okay ideally churches should be doing this the Christian family should be doing this okay um, create a giant health food buffet in the center of town with Christ's name all over it, make the eating area huge and free sitting, just like a giant cafeteria with long tables that can seat ideally thousands of people. It should be the biggest built It should be the biggest building in town. Okay, it's not expensive to create just a giant sheltered area, okay, that people can eat in. And it's called community, and it's called efficient feeding of the masses in a buffet, in a health food buffet. There goes another. There, there goes another idiotic symptom in this town. Also. Oh.